Russian nationals ice dance. Rise of super nepotism, baby! Diana Davis. I knew Russian national was going to be the gift that keeps on giving. However, this was beyond my imagination. First, I want to say thank you to the Russian audience at this event. Thank you for having the integrity and the dignity that the ISU and the judges have thrown away. We all know what is going on in Russian ice dance is bullshit. And the fact that the Russian audience did not stand for it speaks volume of you as a people. In my last video, when I said that Diana Davis was going to be the national silver medalist at Russian National, it was not because I'm psychic. No, the bull with the side of shit that the ISU and the judges were planning to shove down our throats could be seen from a mile away. Now, the rhythm dance was just a pre-planned outcome of behind the scene dealing. This is just my opinion, but I think the original plan was to screw over Alexandra Stefanova and Ivan Buchan by placing Diana Davis and Gled Smokin ahead of them in the free dance. However, after the rhythm dance, when the audience booed the result of not only Tiffany Zagorski and Jonathan Guerrero, but also that of Annabelle Morozov and Andre Bagan, the plan had to be rethought. I don't think Iteri Tuberexi expected that outcome from how the placement were given. I believe the plan had to be adjusted at that at this point. Iteri was still going to have her daughter get the silver medal. However, it could not be achieved head on anymore. As for Victoria Senesina and Nikita Kasalapov, I'm glad they decided to put their health above everything else. Hopefully, they will be healthy for European and the Olympic. Now, having said that, I have to point out that the Russian Federation has been pushing Victoria and Nikita as a gold medal contender for the last two years. So it was already a foregone conclusion that they were going to be sent to the Olympic. Now, let us also remember that their coach is none other than Alexander Julen, one of the loudest members of the Iteri Tuberetsi cheering squad. Now, it's just my opinion. However, while pulling out of national mean losing their chances at, at a national title, it would not really hurt Vicky and Nikki's Olympic chances. Since the Russian Federation was going to push for them anyways, I feel like the withdrawal of Nikki and Vicky helped the plan go ahead to have Nepo baby of the century, Diana Davis, clinch that gold medal. It could have all been a coincidence, but I'm just saying it just worked out a little too perfectly. Now, as for the competition itself, after the rhythm dance, Vicky and Nikki were in first, and Alexand Alexandra and Ivan were in second, and Diana and Gleb were in third. The judges placed Diana and Gleb ahead of Tiffany and Jonathan, as well as Annabelle and Andre. I will be perfectly honest. Diana and Gleb's rhythm dance was tight, slow, with a lot of two-foot skating. I would have had them in seventh place at the rhythm dance and in seventh place overall. They, they are a skating team who are currently at a junior level. I'm not saying they do not have the potential to one day become silver national medalists. I'm stating that they are not there right now. My heart breaks for Tiffany and Jonathan. I made a video a few months ago saying that Iteri was going to take that third spot from them in order to get Diana on that Olympic team. And I said this before Tiffany got sick and the pair lost an entire figure skating worth of competition this season. In my opinion, I think Tiffany and Jonathan knew their chances were slim. I think they still had a small bit of hope in their heart. However, I feel after seeing that rhythm dance score, they broke. They went into the free dance with no hope, knowing that years of their life spent working hard was now wasted. 
They knew that their hope of making the Olympic team was dead before they stepped foot on that ice and they knew nothing they would do could change that. To me, being spiritually and mentally broken, I feel like Tiffany just did not have what it took to overcome her physical limitation because she already knew the truth. Sadly, they were not even the only victim of Russian nationals for ice dance. Another victim at the national was Anastasia Skopsova and Kirill Alashin. I feel like because Anastasia's mother spoke out against what was going on, the judges decided to punish this team and bury them. I really think that Alexandra and Ivan deciding to join force with Nikolai Morozov was really a godsend. The rework program, long program, is now one of my favorite. And they stepped on center ice with confidence. They had power. In that short dance, they were like, no, we're not going down without a fight. This was the cleanest, the crispest, the most on point I've seen them the entire season. I was so happy to hear the cheers of the fans and seeing how much support they were getting. I hope they can continue this momentum to European as well as the Olympics. With the Europeans coming up, I will make another another prediction. Nepotism baby of the century Diana Davis will be the European bronze medalist. Yes, after watching Russian National, there is now no doubt in my mind that the power of Iteri Tuberetsi is absolute. The ISU judge, the ISU and the judges will only ask how high when Iteri tells them to jump. So while, while we all may know that we this is all a bunch of bullshit, the judges, I feel, in my opinion, at, at Europeans, will screw over the Italian team, they'll screw over both of the Spanish team, and they will screw over everyone else in order to put Diana Davis and Gled Smoking on their European podium. This is Iteri's world, and we are just enjoying the drama. I honestly, part of me cannot wait for European and part of me is seriously fearing it. Because if what we saw at National is only the tip of what is to come, I feel like whatever, whatever I had left for this sport will truly be killed. I mean, I cannot wait to see what new height nepotism of the century, baby! Diana Davis will reach at European. What did you guys think of Russian nationals? Did you agree with the podium? Did you disagree with the podium? Did you think Diana Davis and Gleb Smokin won that silver medalist? Let me know in the comments below and also let me know what you think is going to happen at Europeans.